you know, sometimes the kids ask on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, why well, you always practice two minutes. And I've been, we've been doing it for 30 years, and you always say, and the kids go, how come? Well, the last two weeks, we needed it. Uh, we got the ball back with two and a half minutes to go. We were losing MIT 28-24, and we drove the length of the field uh, and scored uh, the winning touchdown with uh, 23 seconds to go. And the great thing about, I like about two minutes is it, it gives the kids a chance to play football. It's funny, when I was a quarterback, I call my own plays back uh, when I was in high school. It's the only time that a quarterback actually, you know, you sit there and just watch because he's in control. And Kevin Fruitworth, uh, who's a young quarterback, has done a great job for us this year. He was 28 of 49. He threw for 326 yards. Uh, the other nice thing is uh, the offensive staff has become much better in the last two weeks. We've become much better coaches because uh, Rob Bambini is there. He had 13 catches for 225 yards and the winning touchdown catch. So he is an outstanding wide receiver. He's healthy now, and uh, that makes a big difference for us. Uh, Richard Johnson was the ECAC and NEFC uh, Special Teams Player of the Week. He returned a kickoff uh, 85 yards for a touchdown, another one 50 yards. And uh, my shout-out is to the uh, offensive halfback from uh, MIT. Uh, Brad Goldsberry had 326 all-purpose yards. He was <coughs> outstanding. He is a very good football player. We traveled to Endicott. Uh, always, as I said, Coach Kelly's talking about the Kelly Cup. Coach Bandini's son plays for Endicott. Uh, we don't like them. They don't like us. And uh, thank God Bandini's kid is a senior and be graduating, but I don't think that'll uh, stop the animosity. <laughs>